Hello and welcome back here to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit. We are sitting in the victory box of Wembley Arena for round four of ESDA. Round four of ESDA was definitely a fun round. Didn't get into the winner's circle after not actually qualifying for 32s, but I did get a chance to go up against a Brazilian YouTuber, Andreo Machado. He's definitely a very solid driver, and I will leave his link in the description box. So it was a fun celebrate battle going against another YouTuber, toe-to-toe. -to -toe. It was definitely a close battle. I was not really that close in the chase, but unfortunately, I was trying to catch up after a few little hiccups and some nerves so we're gonna take a look at my practice qualifying as well as a battle and the podium esports broadcast from the, the celebrity battle between me and machado so make sure you guys follow me on all social media all of which are found in the description box below let's get to it unfortunately in the first qualifying run i forgot to heat up my tires so going into outer zone two uh, I ended up looping it, so unfortunately that was a zero. I was feeling pretty pretty pumped on the wall ride, and then coming in here to Outer Zone 2, as you can see, unfortunately did not have the grip I wanted right there, and ended up looping it and zeroing out. Unfortunately, I managed to fix that in run two, which we're going to take a look at here in a second. So for run two, as you can see, and here, I did manage to actually heat up my tires we're taking a look from the judging perspective run two was a lot better i was feeling super confident going into this outer zone you know dropping just one tire on that line a nice hook in a very fluid line and then a little hesitant going into outer zone two and managed to get full into it but everything was feeling comfortable feeling great until Midway through here, as you can see, the car does a little weird, and I'm able to keep it an angle, but unfortunately, that was not the perfect line, so unfortunately, I was given a 72. All right, driver's ready. Three, two, one, go. Alright, driver is ready. Round number four here at the Wembley Arena, otherwise known as the capital of Italy. Thank you so much for That's being so here tonight. It's been a phenomenal battle. And again, this is the final lobby of the day. But before we can get down into the final four, I believe we have yet another celebrity battle getting ready to, to line up here. If you could please explain to our lovely viewers at home who we got on the line here. Who's going to be doing battle here? We have... Andrew K, also known as Evil Rabbit, just congrats by the way, uh, Evil Rabbit, for getting uh, that subscriber milestone. I think he just 
past 25,000 subscribers hey, recently. I know he hit some sort of subscriber milestone recently, so congrats to him. Driving the blue and white NRG S15. And hold on, Brazil, because Andre Machado it will be battling him again. Uh, another Brazili a Brazilian YouTuber. Uh, does a lot of drifting stuff, a lot of Assetto Corsa stuff, 130,000 subscribers, so congrats uh, to both of them for their continued success on YouTube. Um, I think both do some little bit of streaming, a little bit of uh, YouTubing, so if you want some stuff to watch and you speak Portuguese, go check out uh, Adriel Machado. If you do not speak Portuguese, go check out the boy Evil Rabbit, EVL Rabbit. Ah, this will be a very fun one as both drivers on the line. It looks like we are going to have... Adriel leading first, and Andrew will be chasing first on... Yeah, they battle. didn't give us an order, so the graphics are wrong. Our bad. Yeah, we do apologize. This is a uh, seat of the pants, beautifully painted S15s as well. Here we go, then. Your celebrity battle of round before all oh, the LEDs on the fans blink in sequence in the back of Evil Rabbit's car. I don't know if you can see this, Keenan. I see that. That's sick. That is sick. Here we go. That S15 versus S15 battle. Adriel up in the lead, getting a nice gap through outer zone number one. Andrew needs to close in that gap. Oh, the gap will be as it has happened. There is a table for one, my friend. You got to make it a table for two. Get in the door. Still struggling to get it back into the side of Adriel running in this picture. Perfect lead run. Who is this man? Adriel running down a dream up in the lead. Andrew just not in the picture in the chase position. Uh, Adriel has been impressive so far. We've seen him in competition, unfortunately, just not being able to make the cut today, but um, being able to get on track and be able to run with Evil Rabbit, just not getting the launch they were looking for, Ian, and just played out throughout the rest of the course of the run from what I saw, just, just playing on the back foot and not able to catch up to Adriel, but oh, perhaps maybe two tires off tires. in the lead. But uh, I want to point out, this is an EU server with the amount of Europeans that showed up today, and both of these are based in, well, well, Evil Rabbit based in North America and Adriel based in Brazil, so South America. So both of these guys just in this. You're going to see a little bit of jitter jattering, but uh, great job from Adriel in the lead. Evil Rabbit needs to get a little bit closer, but we might be able to see him pull something out here in the lead position. Yeah, in regards to their connections to the server, the gap is is not closing. Indeed, was no. to say. Off the line, Evil Rabbit will get their chance at the lead this time. Adriel in the chase position. Let's see what's, oh man, the, the, the bobbling from these connections is super real, but they're going to run it out regardless. Adriel getting a little more aggressive in chase in comparison to what Evil Rapple did in the chase position. Putting their car up the lungs, making a little bit of a dive into outer zone number two. Oh, beautifully held for Andrew up in the lead position. Running that line and running down that motor to the ground all over the limiter in the lead. But Adriel in the door, in the picture, running straight into the side of that leading S15. Now... No, no, no. We got to see if the judges are going to go with their hearts on this decision or if they're going to go with the rule book on this decision. It depends on what happened with the rear tires of Patriel on outer zone number one's exit. Pay attention to that white line. That is a massive deduction as far as the scoring goes. If this is indeed a two-tire drop, there's one. Ooh, it's close. It's very close, Keena. But regardless, appreciate them both coming out and being our celebrity battle of the day and putting down a nice little fun exhibition event before we get down into the schmeat of round mm -hmm. number four. Five, only four more drivers left in this battle, and this, there's some doozies coming up. So again, big appreciations, big ups to these these uh, these YouTubers and um, and social media influencers for coming out and, and putting on a show for us here at Podium Esports. Yeah, I mean, shout out, shout out to, to both of them. Again, these boys need some content, but Adriel just, uh, that wouldn't be a two tire drop, just for clarification, because you are allowed one. So technically it's a tire drop. So might, there might be a world where that evens out with Evil Rabbit not really being there in yeah. chase. But, um, you know, we got to see the best of Evil Rabbit in the lead. So it's not like they'll be going out without a little bit of a fight. But that will be Brazil with the win. Adriel Machado will be getting the win and moving on into my heart. So overall, it was an amazing event. Had a lot of time going against Andreo Machado in the celebrity battle. Definitely a very solid driver from Brazil and makes amazing content. Like I said, I'll leave his link in the description box below. Him and I did some celebratory donuts in the parking garage after our celebrity battle. Big congratulations to him for taking on that win. Did uh, have a little bit of a few bobbles and things like that, but overall, once again, a big thank you to ESDA and everybody 
at ESDA for allowing me the opportunity to do this. It's such an amazing time and I can't wait to continue to improve my driving, continue and get maybe into a 32 battle. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media, all the trans from the box below. I'll see you guys on the track.